some nap time. I'm supposed to put it on your lap. Uh, let's see. It's the morning. Uh, I think I'll take my blood pressure pill. Oh, I hear the dog out there. The lights come up. The dog wants to take a walk. It's a walk. Uh, where my glasses at? Oh, I don't need the glasses. What the heck? Uh, I've been writing. Uh, usually the morning I get up and I'm, well, I do stuff in the day that I take the dog for a walk. It's been, well, the dog's got to wait. Um, yesterday, between yesterday and today, or two days ago, whatever, I've been writing Consaba. Uh, Consaba is the uh, Eugene Wedman form. I'll tell you about that in a little while. But, uh, you know, at, at the internet is buzzing. Well, my, my part of the internet is buzzing because South Africa, there's a bunch of attacks, South, South, South African attacking uh, Nigerians. So there's uh, the uh, so called xenophobia, which now uh, years ago, well, years ago, years ago, I guess, started with the. Um, you know, with Somalians and, and the Ethiopians, whatever, kind of coming down. Uh, now it's spread, not spread, but now it's the Nigerians. It's all about shops. It's all about the economy. That's really what it's about. And I won't get into it right now, but the only people that's making sense, right? Actually, I'm wearing my Bangalisa Robert Sabukwe, one of his shirts, where he says, uh, We are fighting for the noblest of cause, the noblest cause on earth, the liberation of mankind. You can't see that. That's what it says right there here, the liberation of mankind. That's Mangalisa Robert Sabukwe, who's a uh, my number one South African hero. You know, you have Chris Honey too, but those are the two people that I, the people I hang out deal with. Uh, and the only people, that, as this thing happens, the only people that's making any sense. Only the, I haven't seen everything, of course. But the only person that's making any sense is uh, the head of the um, Economic Freedom Fighters, which is uh, Jews Malema. The economic freedom fight is a political party in South Africa. I'm not really into political parties, but if you're going to be a political party spokesperson, then you need to speak, right? And the uh, the other people and other parties, I haven't heard them speak, but um, of course, Malema gets press, and what he spoke makes more sense than all the other speaking. I'll let you do your own research. I mean, I stay on that. So I got this beret a long time. When, when the party first started, how many years ago? Because I got it on, because to tell you the truth, okay, I'm going to tell you the truth. I knew it was going to be historic, right? This is the quality one. This is real quality. It's uh, it's the original EFF hat. So anyway, EFF beret, whatever it is. <laughs> so I'm wearing that for them. And I'll put my glasses up and read something. Uh, there's some consapers because I was at... Uh, 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 I was at the um, Eugene, Ribbon, Eugene B. Ribbon Writers... Uh, club in uh, East St. Louis uh, a couple of days ago, yeah, a couple of days ago, and uh, I, I I requested that they write Consabas. Uh, uh, Consabas was invented by Eugene Reppin like in the 90s, 95 or something, in the mid 90s. Um, and uh, in fact, it was interesting because I gave, a, I talked to them about ADOS, and in that talk, and when we was talking, I had said something. I was, I was saying, Kusaba, now it's really interesting. I, I can't explain this, but I'll put the link of what was said. But then when I say the word Kusaba, I sort of was mouthing it at the same time. The, the president of the Writers Club, Darlene Roy, she said the word out loud. And it's just very interesting. These are the kind, um, sometimes when I do, uh, it's, just, it's just magical to me. Uh, so anyway. So I, uh, I I wrote now, Kwasaba is very not very easy. It's uh, it's it's a seven line poem with seven words in each line, no word more than seven letters, right? Except for proper 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 nouns. Okay. Um, now uh, 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 one more thing. I'm at JB's house tonight, and um, <laughs> watching was watching. I was watching. I'm watching the series of Game of Thrones. And some for right before JB left for Mexico because he's doing something. He's learning Spanish or something like that. I don't know whatever he's doing. Uh, so he's some sort of house sitting. Um, and I uh, uh, haven't been able to post. But anyway, his son, uh, JC, this is his um, his laptop. It's on my lap. That's what laptops do. Um, I had to borrow, but he let, let me hold it so I can post up, you know, because I haven't been able to post up a few days. Um, anyway, we was watching Game of Thrones, and, you know, the guy. Uh, John Snow, whatever we have. 
seven, something, I think it was in episode, I don't know, maybe it was in season three or something like that. And I'm going, I'm sitting there going like, that John Snow guy, he never follows any orders. Right? And JB said, thanks me. He's one of my oldest friends. I've known this as well since the early 70s. He says to me, he says to me, no, well, neither do you. Or he says something like, just like you. And I stopped. And I couldn't, I didn't have any retorts. So I just shut up. <laughs> So anyway, I bring all that up with, with the cassava, <laughs> cassavas only because that's the rules of cassava. But I wrote a, let's call it a pre-cassava, because remember, I'm living this out, doesn't matter, but pre-cassava. Pre and, uh, you know, I write first, and then I, whatever, it's like a process. When I was writing plays, back here writing plays, I always write it out first. Then I, you know, make some corrections or whatever. Then I type it, which more corrections come. So here's the first one I wrote. Now, this one's a little different because it's not seven words, it's seven syllables. Yeah. I use seven syllables, uh, it's seven line poems, seven syllables, right? And uh, this is what it is. When I write my name as a poet, I put the poet and then, I, I, when I type, I type the poet and then I write my name over it. Anthony's like script, so here I just, and it doesn't matter. Uh, so I just have the, the, the cursory kind of thing right there. This is the poem, this is the title, Right, I think the title even has seven, whatever. But here it says the title is uh, An Elder's Sight in Our Fight. An Elder's Sight in Our Fight. Sloan's Perpetual Consaba. Uh, the weed of they are released, stopping those conquered ring shores, missions of forevermores. Our weapons of depths do is a tip of this spear clearly sharpening by clearly sharpened by Clamata's hurling this liberation okay let me read that again so sure let me read it again I'm why you won't see it again the we of they are released stopping those conquering conquer slash ring shores missions of forevermores our weapons of depths do, in the tip of this spear, clearly sharpened by Lamata, hurling this liberation. Oh, just for you alone. Uh, Lamata is um, it's, 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 the, it's the most um, thing for God. It's just that I'll be short like that. And I, maybe I'll put some links that explains that too. In fact, I'll make sure the poem is um, in the, the show notes so that you can see what it looks like because part of part of this kind of poetry is the, the look of the poem. Then I had to do, of course, because I have to obey the rules <laughs> hard. <laughs> I have to obey, obey the rules of, of the uh, uh, the Quonsaba as invented by the uh, by Eugene B. Redmond or uh, whatever. Um, <laughs> so it says uh, an ADOS Quonsaba for our current struggle. Okay? So here it goes. The we of they were said free. Even slash as. Okay, it's even. It's like even as. Okay? It's even slash as. Um, you have to see the show notes. Let me start it over again. Sorry about that. And ADOS Quinsaba for uh, our current struggle. And ADOS Quinsaba for our current struggle. The we of they were said free, even as newly wicked laws rebound our feet, causing more mayhems, more self-corrupt sons, bringing the blues through rope chain burns, red lines, and deals that tear binds. However, no mores arise from silver rights ADOS spear tipping our current freedom fight. Again, you're going to have to see the poem because remember, it's just the, the Presley Consabas. Consabas are not only the words, but you know, it's like sight, you know, what I mean? it's like art, okay? So, for instance, uh, you know, Consabas struggle, right? The way they, uh, even slash as, so even as, let's pronounce even as as one word. So that's like one word, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So seven words, you see? Get it? But the, even, the slash makes it one. You'll figure it out. Causing more mayhems, more self corruption sons, S U N S, not S O N S, corrupt sons. Um, 
you'll, you'll get it when you see the show notes. Bringing the blues through rope chains burns, rope chain burns, like like, like chain gangs, right? The the the, the noose, you know, burning of the bodies. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, uh, red line, the red lining thing. Uh, this is the history of red lining, you know, from um, oh, you get it. Uh, red uh, the blues, uh, rope chain burns, red lines, and deals that tear by that make you cry. Okay, deals, you know, this whole. Um, thing of uh, you know mass incarceration all that stuff is, is in that, that section right uh, however no wars arise from silver rights silver I get that from uh, you know turning automatic silver with the dollar sign rights that whole civil rights movement those pimps that are now you know claiming they're, they're bona fides and silver rights well they're all pimps okay just like South African you know the the, 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 the new voice you know the people whatever get into the people like it, get me all messed up, which is causing the problem stuff. I won't get it right now. ADO is spear tipping, right? We're just tipping the spears, right? Our current freedom fight. So that's what I've been doing for the last two days, right? In Quinn's um, right, That's what I've been doing. I right, being me. T from the Patterson's has taken the train to Tibet, letting you know what I only suspect from a reality of the AD. OS, what that would be the North American descendants of chattel slavery. Real 